All right guys, today I'm going to be testing out the Liquamali engine flush. I actually used this on my last oil change uh, and I was curious, did some uh, reading and looking at other videos. Uh, looks like a lot of people have great success with this stuff. And so I am gonna go ahead and uh, test it out in this oil change. This truck has uh, just over 90,000 miles as a reference point. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to take some oil out. It's got about 3000 miles on this, uh, oil change. We're going to take some oil out. We're going to look at it. Then I'm going to run this through it. And we're going to see if the oil that I take out with this looks any different. So let's go ahead and pull out some oil just to be kind of our test. Uh, and we're going to do that with my pump. I really like using this little pump. I'll put a link in the description for folks who have this kind of uh, suction plug here. Uh, it's pretty common on European vehicles to have this. Uh, it's just going to be a little, let's see if the camera can get it. It's just going to be a little uh, port there that you put this on. And we're going to go ahead and take out just a little bit. Now I did run this vehicle somewhat beforehand. <laughs> Warm up the oil. All right. So this oil only has about 3,000 miles on it, but it was through desert, high speed, um, and just in general, not the not the best conditions. Uh, but it's right around 2,900 miles or so on this oil. I'm gonna put this in. And let's just take this out real quick. Get it out of the way. We're gonna run this for 15 minutes per the instructions, and then we'll pull it out and see what it looks like. Okay, I uh, just ran this for 15 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and take some out and we'll take a look at it. I did drain out the this pump, uh, so the pump doesn't have any of the previous oil in it so that we can get kind of its own sample. Okay, let's see here. All right, let's get the cap on this. Okay, so this is what looks like after the engine flush. And let me get that other bottle here. Okay, so this is the pre-engine flush. And here's the post. get some of it honestly in person it doesn't look very different um, I'll go ahead and do a smaller oil change interval next time so we get cleaner oil to start with I was kind of prompted to do this video because the last time I used this engine flush at 87,000 miles for this vehicle, um, 
the the engine noise was pretty significantly reduced so i thought i was going to see a bunch of kind of sediment and other stuff picked up but really if you're standing in person you probably couldn't tell these two oil samples apart i think it's going to take a lab to see what kind of difference now if your vehicle has two three hundred thousand miles on it you know maybe it's a more stark difference uh, or maybe the last time I used this, it kind of got everything out, which is why it looks the same. Um, obviously this oil is darker, so it's a little bit difficult to see, but you can't, so if you look here, you see when the oil recedes, there's no, there are no like little particles or anything that's significantly different on the stuff with the engine flush in it. So I would call this one kind of inconclusive uh, and I'll do it at the next oil change. Uh, maybe I'll do it in a thousand miles or 2000 miles just so that the difference in color will be helpful, but I'm not seeing any significant kind of sediment in this sample. It is recommended to do this for these vehicles by FCP Euro in their oil change kit to use it every time. Um, so for whatever that's worth. Uh, but yeah, oil looks the same to me between this one and the stuff before the flush. I'll go ahead and finish up this oil change.